I have an iPad Mini 6 keyboard case that's not like the others. Hello and welcome back YouTube, it's VLD. I always like presenting my iPad Mini 6. That's my always go-to device when I travel. I always like reviewing keyboard cases just because they're unique and they are always something a little bit different. And in today's review, I have one by a company called P-Boy. Like I said, P-Boy. I found this off Amazon. I will list this down below. You can pick this up for about $50 right now. This keyboard comes in about 12 different colors. I picked up the green one just so it would stand out a little bit more compared to the sea of other keyboard cases I have that are just black. When you open it up, it's more of a flipbook case style. Inside of the box, you are given a USB, a type A cable, your instructions, the usual stuff. This keyboard attaches to the case via magnets. I'm not particularly a fan of this style of keyboard case, but this one stood out far enough, so I give it a shot. This keyboard has the same round buttons like the Logitech K280, but unfortunately, it's not like that. On the side, you have the USB type C charger, also an on and off switch because some of them don't have that some of them do putting it inside the case is fairly easy you can actually tear off the case itself and then just pop it in unfortunately you cannot use a sleeve with your apple pencil which that's kind of a trade-off with this style of case the cover itself attaches to the case via magnets it will hold up pretty snug you have all your cutouts for everything for charging volume up and down this does not have raised weight which is unfortunate because some of these style of cases do have it but this one does not. This actually has a kickstand built into the case itself. It folds and bends on the back side of it and you attach it via magnet to the case to the sleeve. I have a magnetic field viewer sent to me by Medicino. I will list that down below. Essentially this lets you see all the magnets built to whatever product you own without actually tearing it open. This keyboard does have a lot of magnets built into the case. It'll be more secure. It will hold everything more into place. So more magnets usually means it's better. There's not really much saving grace with this product. Back of the keyboard will fold down for a stand attached to your keyboard. You do have the option of turning off this trackpad, which trust me, it's fairly small. All the gestures will not work. One finger click and dragging will work. Clicking, selecting, left click will work. Right click will work also. Scrolling up and down is just okay. It works slightly better than some of the other keyboard cases I've reviewed in the past, but that's all you can do. You can pinch to zoom. You can zoom in or out. You can swipe back or forth from web pages. You can even swipe up or down to get to the home screen or any of the three or four finger gestures with this trackpad. Just because it's so small, it's really cramped and it's not a good experience overall. I even have a smaller keyboard case with a much smaller trackpad that I have reviewed about a month or two ago. That's even tinier than this. Typing on this is a little bit better than my other keyboard cases. The buttons are round. It's a hard plastic. They are a little bit mushy they're not completely firm with them being round you have more travel and the keys are a little bit bigger the travel with them are a little bit higher it's hard to explain but some of the other flipbook keyboard cases I've reviewed have been trash there's not as much flex with this it's still cramped small and typing is still fairly subpar I would not recommend this for typing if you have other similar keyboard cases like this you can mix and match cases and colors I own a couple similar cases to this so I could add green to black black or blue or green and blue or however I want it's not really a feature it's just something I want to throw out there so if you ever want to mix and match colors if you have multiple keyboard cases like this which you should reevaluate your life but you do have that option like myself I have about four of these you can pick this off Amazon right now for $49.99 under $50 it comes in about seven to eight different colors they make a very variation for the Air, the Mini 6, and the Pros, but there are better options out there, and especially for the Mini 6. This is the Microsoft Surface Alternative I have reviewed a few months ago. By all means, this is not the best keyboard case out there, but this is within the top five I've reviewed. It's backlit, you get raised away 
like it charges USB Type-C. I love the design. It's rugged. You can tear off the keyboard case. It has a much bigger trackpad. And all in all, this is a better build product for the Mini 6. All around, much, much better for any sub $30 keyboard case. You can get this off Alibaba for under $30 with shipping. But this is much better than Peabody case I'm reviewing. Any of the flipbook style keyboard cases, I don't like. They tend to be poorly built. I've reviewed about a dozen of them over the course of the last year. And then they're all the same. They're all not great in my own opinion. This keyboard, the Microsoft Alternative keyboard, just miles better. It's it's built better. It's tough. You could whip this against the wall. It will not break. I cannot give this keyboard enough praise that it deserves. In conclusion, this keyboard is poorly built. It's just average at best. The typing experience is fairly subpar. The keys aren't really the best typing experience. The hinge that holds it up in place isn't great. It's this keyboard case. It's a little bit different, but it's still mostly the same of any of the other flipbook style keyboard cases I have reviewed in the past. For a cheaper price, for a better performance, for better build quality, I highly recommend the Microsoft Surface Alternative just because you get more features. It's better 99% of the time. And I've praised that in the past. It's easily within my top five favorite keyboard cases. So like always, I'm your host, VLD. Smash that bell and subscribe. Peace.